theft, vandalism, random violence, and even terrorist attacks. They are all threats to the safety and security of people and public and private facilities. From private homes to industrial facilities, petrochemical installations, ports, airports, nuclear plants, warehouses. They all need to be kept under surveillance and protected against crime. Installing fences is a solution for protecting facilities against crime. Sometimes they even generate an automatic alarm when someone touches the fence. Or they can be electrified to keep intruders away. Fences are, however, a very expensive solution, since a lot of civil work needs to be carried out. Fences can also be complemented with security guards. Another solution is closed-circuit television, or CCTV, cameras. Easy to use and inexpensive, they're an effective tool for security and surveillance applications. Where the extra electronic eye is in place, people tend to think twice before attempting to commit a crime. But CCTV cameras are not the perfect solution. In order to see with a CCTV camera, you need light. During the day, this is not a problem, most of the time. But what about climatic conditions like light fog, rain and snow? What will you detect when the camera is blinded by the sun? And what can you see in total darkness? Light can only penetrate a certain distance and completely illuminating an area so that it can be kept under surveillance of CCTV cameras is not always possible and can be an expensive exercise. Powering and maintaining it can be even more costly. Light can also be very intrusive and light pollution needs to be considered as well. Furthermore, lighting essentially lays out a route of attack for intruders, creating shadows in which they can hide and access undetected. An excellent and cost-effective solution for seeing in total darkness in the most diverse weather conditions is thermal imaging. Thermal imaging cameras create a crisp image based on subtle differences in temperature called heat signatures. Virtually everything in our environment has a heat signature, even ice cubes. Warmer objects appear white, cooler objects appear black. Thermal imaging is not the same as using night vision goggles. Night vision goggles only work if at least some light, like moonlight or starlight, is present. They amplify small amounts of visible light so that objects can be seen at night. Thermal imaging works by detecting the heat energy being radiated and needs no light at all. Another technology is infrared illuminators. Not only do they consume a lot of power, they do not have a good scene contrast and range performance. Thermal imaging cameras produce a clear image and need no light or illumination whatsoever. Furthermore, intruders using night vision goggles can detect infrared illuminators and navigate around them. Thermal imaging cameras help security professionals to spot intruders in total darkness. Thermal imaging cameras are also useful during daylight. Not only can they see through light fog, but thermal contrast is extremely difficult to mask. People trying to camouflage themselves or hiding in shadows or bushes will become clearly visible on a thermal image. FLIR systems markets a full range of thermal imaging cameras, which have especially been developed for security and surveillance applications. The VSR6 is an extremely affordable thermal imaging camera. It produces thermal images of 160 by 120 pixels. It's an excellent camera for users that have only short range requirements and want to detect man size or bigger targets. 
The Patrol IR is available in two versions, fixed mounted or pan and tilt. The pan and tilt version allows you to see plus or minus 180 degrees horizontally and plus or minus 45 degrees vertically. This offers superb situational awareness. The Patrol IR provides crisp, clear thermal imagery in total darkness and light fog or smoke. It features the same thermal imaging technology found in many of FLIR's most sophisticated security systems. FLIR Systems markets the SR series cameras with different lenses. The user can choose between a 19, 35, 50 or 100 mm lens. Longer lenses have a narrower field of view and give you the possibility to see targets which are further away. The PTZ35MS and PTZ50MS combine a thermal imaging camera with a daylight low light camera. Both cameras are integrated into a compact pan and tilt enclosure. Joystick operation allows the user to see plus or minus 200 degrees horizontally and plus or minus 60 degrees vertically. The user can choose a version with a 35mm or 50mm lens. The daylight camera offers a 25 times optical zoom and can be used when conditions permit. The PTZ35 by 140MS is a powerful multi-sensor mid-range thermal night vision system. It features two thermal imaging cameras and one daylight low light camera. One thermal imager has a wide angle field of view and is ideal for situational awareness. The other with a narrow field of view allows you to see objects that are very small or far away. The PTZ35 by 140MS overlays both images to provide a high resolution image without losing broad situational awareness. Thanks to the two independent thermal imaging cameras, the PTZ35 by 140MS is equipped with a continuous zoom on the thermal image. The PTZ35 by 140MS also features a daylight low light camera. It gives you additional information and identification when conditions permit. The PTZ35 by 140MS comes with a fully integrated pan and tilt. It provides you with a full 360 degree viewing capability. A fixed mounted version of the PTZ35 by 140MS is also available. A question often asked is, how far can you see with a thermal imaging camera? Although the answer is complicated and depends on a lot of variables, it can be stated that longer lenses have a narrower field of view and give you the possibility to see targets which are further away. A VSR6 thermal imaging camera equipped with a 6mm lens can detect a man at a distance of 100 meters in total darkness. A PTZ35 by 140MS equipped with a 140mm lens allows you to detect man-sized targets over 2 kilometers away. 
All FLIR systems thermal imaging cameras are easy to install and to use. They can be easily connected to common power and video interfaces found in existing and new security systems. They can be configured for standalone use as part of a TCP IP network or in a hybrid configuration with local and network based control. They provide early detection and visibility 24 7 all the year round. A software developer's kit is available for integrating FLIR Systems thermal imaging cameras into the network. Protect your valuable facilities, assets and personnel in total darkness, in all weather conditions and start using the power of thermal imaging today.